Okay. On our way. Area's not bad, actually. Unlikely to dazzle. Make a good first impression, though. Certainly no Corpo Plaza. No. But life's livable here. No worse places to raise kids. Randy's problems with the law. Those didn't pop out of thin air. True. But Randy takes after his old man. He'd find trouble in a nicer neighborhood, too. Apparently the worst city between the Atlantic and the Pacific. But I sure do love this view. Find it calming. Scrapers actually seem pretty majestic from out here. Not seeing what goes on inside. Memories? High stress, dirty backstabs, kind of pressure that gives you ulcers. Somehow, I just don't miss it. Got something for you. Wow. What's the occasion? Aiming to close the door. A stage of my life is done. This thing holds too many memories. Won't let me do that. It'll serve you better. Thank you. Just promise you won't blow your foot off. Oddly specific request. Josh's husband did it. Drunk. This very spot. Which made this your special spot. Family landmark? Something of the kind. All right, V. You know why we're here, don't you? Say you do. Please, don't string me along. That the pickup line you settled on? Because maybe heard three in my life that were worse. And just a little at that. Wouldn't mind hearing him. Yeah. Happy to oblige. Will you swallow? Beautiful. <laughs> you serious? This guy and I, sitting in a diner. Five minutes, he gapes at me. Not a word. Then, drops that bomb. Oof. So I'm at a bar, and this gonk taps me on his shoulder and says, Here I am, baby. You got two wishes left. What'd you say? Spoke my second wish. That he would fuck off. Was there a third? Mm-hmm. Wished him a speedy recovery. Broken arm. Merciful, I'd say. I'll fuck you for free. <laughs> what? Got a contract to pull info out of a gigolo in a tech mink fedora. It was weird, he was spilling. And then, he pulled that one out of his hat. A candid and generous proposal, V. You should have at least considered it. Okay, last one was good. You know, woman once told me I have sexy calves. That's it? Just like her boyfriends before he lost his legs in the war. Yikes. She was right, though. I do have great calves. I see what you're doing, River. And how am I doing? Do I stand a chance? Just don't fall in love with me. Too late, V. Too late.
Christ, V. Can't believe you're making me fuck a cop. Gonna go plug my ears, gouge out my eyes. Be ready in a jiff. <sighs> oh, Prem. Talked in your sleep, you know? Yeah. I dreamt of a warehouse, searching containers in it. Warehouse must have been huge. <laughs> you were loud. Taste it. Best coffee you've ever had, I bet. Best jambalaya, best coffee. Mm-hmm. Come on, keep it coming, and? Just that. So, I've uh, been thinking. What? Last night, you and me. Is this going anywhere, you know, longer term? Listen, River, what happened, it was real. It was good. But... I can't make any plans for the future. There's this thing... That you couldn't tell me about. I know. Call it veteran cop intuition. It's why I tried to tell you something yesterday. About myself. To give me courage? Boost it? Oh, no. So you'd know exactly how fucked up I am. Give you a chance to consider if you even want me. River, I'm dying. Wanna haggle on? Try to outdo that? What? Wasn't just me you spent the night with. Sharing headspace with a construct I caught like some disease. All because of an experimental Arasaka biochip. Construct? You mean, like, somebody's mind? Mm-hmm. An engram of Johnny Silverhand. Yes. That Silverhand. And it's getting worse. But... Sorry, still not following you. You're talking to V right now. But tomorrow, this could be a self-obsessed dickhead rocker boy. And trust me, you don't want to talk to him. How is that even possible? 
He's displacing my own neural net, River. Gradually destroying my brain. But it's reversible, right? There's no way it could actually kill you. Actually, doesn't look promising. Need to excise him. Get him out of my brain before it's too late. Shit. So, I think we ought to take it easy. You shouldn't get attached. Bullshit, V. It doesn't change a thing. Question is, what do you want? Are you willing to give this a shot? Sorry, but I just can't. V, you don't need to apologize for this like that. I've had a great time with you. But life's life. It goes on. Good morning. Not intruding, I hope. The generator? You remember, right? Oh, fuck. Need me to fix it now? Yeah. Now. Then we go to the hospital. I'd rather have everything ready for when Randy gets back. Don't mind me. And tell Randy I said hello. Oh, damn. Oh, sorry, V. Will I see you later? Yeah, sure. Have a good day, then. What's up with the generator? I don't know, but electricity's out. And then his room needs tidying. I'm supposed to do that? I know how it sounds, but this one time, please. <laughs>